Good evening and welcome to Jim Mullins World of Weather. You clicked on to long range weather forecast discussion for August 15th to the 27th. For the period August 15th to the 19th, Mullins depict a strong ridge near the southern tip of Greenland, which favors a trough over the eastern U.S. and a weaker trough over the northwest. The ensembles depict a flatter period and a low amplitude flow. The east, west, and the southeast will experience below to near normal temperatures. The central states should experience near to above normal temperatures. Going to look now at the period for August 18th to the 22nd. And we're looking here at the GFS, which um, is not in agreement with its ensembles, where the uh, GFS has above normal heights here, above normal heights across this area, and we have a low with a below normal heights over the Aleutians parts of of Alaska. We look at the ensembles. And it forecasts a ridge over the eastern Pacific and a trough in the east. The solution is on line with more of the other models and ensembles. Because this is a GFS where it has above normal heights across this area near zone of flow. We have a ridge here and a ridge here. So the GFS ensembles are opposites, as you can see here. It does have the area of um, above normal heights here near Greenland. Okay, so during this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures here, the southern plains, and this region, near normal elsewhere for precipitation. I am forecasting below normal precipitation for the Northwest, the Southern Rockies, and above normal precipitation for this region. Next, now we're going to look at the period for August 23rd to the 27th. Here we are in the 23rd. The GFS still has um, looks pretty much the same. Still has above normal heights here in the east and to um, the northern Atlantic. Above normal heights here where the GFF, uh, its ensembles has near normal heights across much of the nation. You see here near normal with a zone of flow. We still have our above normal heights here and here. But the um, European ensembles are similar in a way. Where it has above normal heights here and here, but some of the models are indicating uh, below normal heights across the northern plains and northern Rockies. And here's a GFS ensembles and this is forecasting near to above normal heights across much of the nation. So during this forecast period, I'm forecasting above normal temperatures here and along the eastern seaboard and below normal temperatures here and for precipitation forecasting below normal precipitation for this area and above normal precipitation here. So that is a long-range weather forecast discussion for August 15th to the 27th. Thanks for coming to Jim Mundy's World of Weather, and have a good day.